check it out, Casper! everyone and thanks for tuning in, Casper here, and for those of you who have noticed an FPS loss since the uh, tough break update on or around maybe just before the update, there is some potential good news for you. Now this fix won't necessarily work for everyone, so I do apologise if you try this and it doesn't do anything for you, but it definitely worked for me. I went from about 40 to 60 frames on the snowy map, and now I'm getting more like 60 to 100 frames. So I've definitely noticed an improvement myself, and I've spoken to a few people who also have. So let me just show you what the fix is. It's actually completely outside of Team Fortress. It's in Steam itself. You need to go into your Steam settings, and it's basically if you are in the beta, where it says here, beta participation, you just got to opt out of it. Now that might sound a bit like bollocks, but uh, there is some sort of logical thought behind it. It's something to do with VR and or, in fact, big picture. I don't know the exact in and out details of what's happening in the background, but essentially what Steam is trying to do while you're playing a game is support these VR or big picture features, um, which is basically using up some of the processing power that the game would normally use to give you better frames. So when you turn off those features, you get those frames back. Obviously, if you're not in the beta, then this fix isn't going to do anything for you, so I can only apologize apologize for that, but it's definitely worked for me, so I really hope that this will work for some people out there as well. Just for reference, I've got an NVIDIA graphics card, and 970 is the version. I'm on GTX 970. So if you do have that card, it could be related to your graphics card, you might get a bonus as well. But yeah, I really hope this works for you guys, and I'll see you in a live commentary soon.